trash bins. You know, pretty soon after that, we stopped altogether. We were like, this is bad. This is wrong. It's done. I mean, I'm pretty sure I'm the one who brought it up, but he was in agreement. At least to my face, he was. And I really hope that it was genuine when he said that. We didn't look at those websites anymore. We didn't do DDLG anymore. You know, I'm so sorry for fetishizing something so evil, you know? And that's why my relationship with Joel and what evil he inspired in me. You know, for a long time, I thought it was us both equally, but he was encouraging it. And I'm not blaming him. I take full responsibility for what I did. But, like, I was led into this world. I was manipulated into this world, into being okay with this. If you're wondering, if you've been following the Onision fucking Chris Hansen case, and you're wondering how Kai became a child predator, this is how. This is how, and this is how I know that this is not uncommon, and this is what makes me skeptical, because for a long time I just thought, oh, this was, like, a man who genuinely loved me, like, just sharing his, like, deepest, darkest, like, evil secrets with me. No! No, this is common! In child predators, people who want to be with children will find young people that they can get away with being with, and then encourage the same evil in them. And that's why I'm so passionate about Chris Hansen's case.